Hello, my beautiful ladies in the fun, fearless female global community of Christian women with Delinda Lane. I'm Kathy Weaver, and today is Words of Wisdom Wednesday. Whoa, isn't it cool how every week Wednesday comes around, right? I don't know if you guys know this, but I absolutely L-O-V-E love networking. I hear often, sometimes, but kind of often, networking doesn't work. I tried this. It didn't happen. I didn't sell any of my widgets at my favorite group, whatever that is. So because I network pretty much 24-7, yes, even at the grocery store, yes, even at a kid's sport event, yes, even at a kid's concert, I network all the time because I love meeting new people. I love finding out about them. I love finding out what makes them tick. And yes, sometimes I say, where do you go for networking? It's one of my favorite things. And most people are either, what's networking? Or they have a list. So I network online a lot now, simply because it's quicker, easier, more efficient, et cetera. But also the reason I network online now is because of certainly the pandemic, but also I can meet people from other countries. So seriously, the other day, one of my dynamic groups that I love is actually based in India. And while I was perusing the India sites, I found BNI India. It's an incredibly large group, actually. And they posted, the BNI folks posted the 10 commandments of networking. And I'm going to read it verbatim off of their sheet because they posted it publicly. So I want you to hear the 10 commandments of networking as presented from the BNI chapters in India. Number one, thou shalt not sell to me. Number two, thou shalt understand the law of reciprocity. Wowza. Number three, thou shalt not abuse our relationship. Number four, thou shalt not be late. Number five, thou shalt be specific. Number six, thou shalt take your business seriously. Number seven, thou shalt follow up on referrals. Number eight, thou shalt communicate. Number nine, thou shalt protect my reputation. And number 10, thou shalt prepare for success. As soon as I saw that, if everyone had t-shirts made with that, that, that statement, those statements on there, can you imagine how different everything would be? Someone gives you a referral. You might call or email, let me know if you need anything, whatever that looks like. They haven't called in a couple of weeks. Keep them in your file so that it's constantly a drip campaign, if you will, because whatever it was, they were interested in your something originally, or they wouldn't have stated that. And quite frankly, if you don't follow up, they're going to buy a widget from somebody else. What's the reciprocity piece? What's the reciprocity piece? I want you to give. I want me to give. If we're all givers, can you imagine how cool that would be? So with one month left in the month, in the year of 2021, groundhog year number two, as I call it, If you could just live by these commandments, can you imagine how cool it would be for all of us? Everybody wants to sell a million, trillion, zillion of their somethings, but what about your network? Your network determines your net worth. You've heard that before. I believe it. So does apparently BNI India believe it. And now that you've heard the 10 commandments of networking as written by BNI, I just want to see how that resonates with you. Put some comments down here below the video. I'd love to know how that looks for you. And let's think about how we can implement 
those commandments in this last month of 2021. Wowza. Make it a great day, ladies. It's always a great day for me because I L-O-V-E love networking and being part of the fun, fearless female global community of Christian women with my friend, Delinda Lane. Bye for now.